This demo for the Max 635G will focus on the unit's ability to do throughput speed testing. By selecting the DSL IP tests from the home menu, either tapping the touchscreen or using the navigation keys on the keypad, and provided that the unit has been set up ahead of time, in this case for GFAST testing, we simply have to select the manual test. Once we negotiate, in this case, with the GFAST DPU and we achieve showtime, we will then be able to look at the data test summary. From here, you would be able to select speed tests such as the FTP speed test, the HTTP speed test, and the UCLA speed test powered solution. So from the data test summary screen, as I said, you will be able to access the FTP test, the HTTP test, and the UCLA speed test through the throughput test selection. If we select the FTP test, we will now be able to run an upload FTP test and a download FTP test. Provided that the unit has been set up correctly and you do have access to that FTP server, you will be able to select the upload button to do an upload test to that server. You'll be able to select the download button to perform a download test between the server and the Max 635G. Going back to the data test summary screen, we can then select the HTTP test. The HTTP test only allows the downloading of a web object. So by pushing the start button, we're able to download an HTTP object and you'll be able to see on the screen what is the download speed. For the throughput test, you will be able to configure the unit for either iPerf3 testing or UCLA speed testing. If we focus on the UCLA speed test for a moment, you will be able to select the begin test button. In this case, it will then begin the UCLA speed test and you will be able to quickly see what is the upload and download speed pertaining to the UCLA speed test on the Max 635G. That concludes the demonstration of the speed test on the Max 635G. Thank you.